Make your project more visually interesting by creating a color split title using the color fill adjustment layer with the layer mask. This video is being filmed in Photoshop Elements, but the instructions are exactly the same for Adobe Photoshop except for noted. To start this tutorial, I'm beginning with the quick page card front file you can find in the downloads for this lesson, so have that file open and ready to use. The first step of this tutorial is to add the main word to our card front, so get the horizontal type tool. Before I give you the tool settings, I want you to know that the font I use in this lesson can be found for free at fontsquirrel.com. In the tool options, open the font picker and choose the League Spartan Bold font. Set the size to 72 points, the letting to auto, and the tracking to zero. Click on the center alignment icon. Then click on the color chip, and then click on the color wheel to open the color picker, and use hex number D5832D, and then click OK. Photoshop users will need to click on the color chip and use the same hex number, and then click OK to close the color picker. Also note that Photoshop users will need to access the character panel to set the letting and tracking settings. If you need step-by-step -step instructions on how to do that, please see the manual for this tutorial. Now on the document, roughly in the middle of the card, click once to place the cursor. Type the word THANKFUL in all caps, and then once you're done, click the check mark to commit. Now get the move tool and press Control A in Windows or Command A on a Mac to select all. And then in the tool options, click on the Align Vertical Centers icon and the Align Horizontal Centers icon, and then press Control D in Windows or Command D on a Mac to deselect. The next main step we need to do is to create the color split effect. So click on the foreground color chip to open the color picker and choose hex number E E C. 4, 7, C, and then click OK. Now, in the Layers panel, click on the Create a New Fill or Adjustment Layer icon and choose Solid Color. Then click OK. Now, in the menu bar, choose Layer, Create Clipping Mask, and then get the Rectangular Marquee Tool. In the Tool Options, click on the New Selection icon, set the Feather to 0, and set the Aspect to Fixed Size. Enter a Width of 7 inches, and a Height of 2.5 inches. Photoshop set the Style to Fixed Size, and then on the document, click and drag the selection all the way to the top of the document, and then let go. Now in the Layers panel, click on the Layer Mask icon of the Color Fill layer to ensure the layer mask is activated. At this point, your foreground color chip should be black. If it isn't, press the letter X to switch it to black. Now press Alt Backspace in Windows or Option Delete on a Mac to fill the selection with black which will reveal our color split title. Once you're done, press Ctrl D in Windows or Command D on a Mac to deselect. At this point, the card is finished, but if you wanted to add a little more to it, you can copy my example here. So now you can save this card. In the menu bar, choose File, Save As, and save this as a layered PSD file with a unique name. Now your card front is ready for printing or sharing. If you want to print this, I have enclosed a coordinating card inside QuickPage that you can add a personal message to if you like. So that's how you create a fall themed Thanksgiving card with a color split title. This is Jennifer Juris with Digital Scrapper.